Sorry about that. You can see um, <clears throat> on the file size which one of them contains the skin, and that's the big one. So we will start with that in Blender. And we will just pause this one, go down and go into Blender. And this is just a default scene. I deleted the cube. Now I will go to import FBX. Find my folder with the ninja, and now I will sort by size, and I will take the biggest. I will hit S for scale, and press 20 on numpad. And here it is. Now we can open this window up, and we can go to the NLA editor. And here is, this is the main animation, and I would like to rename him as Hero. And I can go down here, you can see the Hero, and you can see the name of the animation. And I will rename that to Little, and press this arrow down here. That's the first animation. Now we're gonna take import the next one, run. And as you can see, you will only get uh, the skeleton, no mesh on this one. But it's okay because we don't we only need yeah, those information. So here you can see it, you got armature, the new one and the new <clears throat> animation and we will rename it to run and click this arrow now it's inside blender we don't need this armature anymore you can delete it and if you hit hold your mouse here and click shift a you can insert another track and you, then you put your cursor about here and hold your cursor over this place and shift a and you got real run. And now your character will run. Now you can see he is moving out of place, which is difficult to control when, uh, example, for example, if you loop this one five times, you can see he snaps back. I don't want that, so we will tap into this one and we will go to the graph editor, select the bones, and here you can see all the keyframes, all the movements. And I want to find the hips, so I will click on this one and search for hips. And here you got all the key points for the hip. And I figured that if you just unselect this one, you, first you have to go to frame one to reset the position, and then you turn off this one. When he starts running, he will run in place. If you click X and Y off, he will no longer go up and down, you can see, if we take side view. And then we can activate them. This is better. So only the set one. Yes. And then we can go back to the Dope NLA editor and click tap. There you have it. For the next animation we are going to say import FBX and maybe take sneak walk. And here it is. I will rename sneak walk and I will click this. And now I don't need the armature anymore. And I can click 
this track, say Shift A, sneak walk, and then he will do this. Oh, something is wrong. Let's just try to tap into this one and go to the graph editor, search for hips, select the bones, and try to take off the C location. Now we can see he's running in. Ah, now I get it. Uh, we have to go back to make him reset his position, you know. If you turn it off here, he will stay here. If you turn it off here, he will stay there. So you have to go back <coughs> to the frame where you want him to be, and then you have to turn it off. Then he will stay there, like so. Then we go back and tap out. Ah, oh, I know. <coughs> you have to... Um, this one overrides this one because it's on top. So there are two ways to get around that. You can either shift A and U track and move this up here. And it will. Or you can put it back there and you can say blend, auto blend. And the same on run, auto blend. Now we will blend slowly into this. Yes, sir. And then uh, they will only blend if they are close to each other like this. If you have more tracks. And I'll put this one up here, for example. It won't blend because they have to be close, apparently. Here it will blend. And it will blend down here. Yes. And then this one also has to have auto blend. And then you will see you go slowly into running. And slowly back to sneak, walk. And we can repeat this one a couple of times. And then we can go over here and we can select this track, Shift A, Idle. And now it's a new Idle, so you have to select it and click Auto Blend again, like this. And if it's too fast, you just grab it. So there you have it. It'll run, sneak, and it'll. Yes, sir. That's it. Hope you could use it. See you in next tutorial.